Breaking news! Earlier today, the NetBSD project announced that their latest release added official support for cheese sandwiches. Quote, NetBSD is famous for running on the sort of resource-constrained hardware that simply cannot handle other Unix-like operating systems, stated Ferdinand Malda, NetBSD project lead. And nothing says resource-constrained quite like a cheese sandwich. Quote, any OS can run on x86, ARM, or MIPS, continued Amalda, but only NetBSD can run on a full, run a full Apache server on a grilled cheese sandwich. Not that it's a competition or anything, but how many types of lunch foods can Linux run on? While official support has existed for some cheese sandwich variants in past releases, the, NetBSD re the latest NetBSD release upgrades cheese sandwiches to an officially supported platform, including support for both grilled and cold variants, along with a variety of peripherals such as mayonnaise, ham, both sourdough and white breads, and tomato soup all of which opens the door for usage in enterprise and high uptime environments. The news was met with swift praise from the developer community, with one engineer declaring, quote, it's great to see NetBSD finally able to run on cheese sandwiches in production. With the supply constraints currently facing the Raspberry Pi along with other single board computers, grilled cheese sandwiches were the most logically delicious replacement for embedded mission critical systems, end quote. Not everyone was happy, however. Representatives of the Meatball Sub Computing Coalition have accused the NetBSD project of, quote, soft sandwich bigotry and, quote, being in the pocket of big dairy. You're welcome. Uh, one take. <laughs> I only screwed up a couple of times. Yeah. Uh, if you don't, you know, subscribe to the, you know, with the things, with the clicking and the whatnot, do that. It's it's great. You love it very much.